Welcome back, everybody, to the Hofkast. We're starting a new series today, and I'm literally starting it because I really like this game. <laughs> so we're going to be playing through Half-Life 2. Um, I cannot guarantee that we'll be finishing this. Oh, jeez. Oh, my gosh. Until... The way he talks well, is so unsettling. Let's just say your hour has come again. Oh man. The G-Man. Where did he get that name from? But um Yeah, welcome right, man, to Half-Life 2. Place can make all the difference in the world. Oh jeez. So Mr. Freeman. Mr. Freeman. Wake up and smell the ashes. Oh Baby, he is creepy as hell. Um, welcome to Half-Life 2. Oh, this game. You didn't see me get on? This is my third transfer this year. Okay. What's up? No matter how many times I've been relocated, I never get used to it. Re relocated for what? Hello. Look at me jumping on the seats. Um... Oh man, what's happening? All right. Oh, oh geez. Ah, far out. Take that. Like, what can I? Wait. Ugh. You, you're, you're forgetting your secondary. Your carry on. Ugh. <laughs> no, it's not. We're just starting. No. I can't talk. All I can do is bother you. Oh, check this out. All right. <laughs> he didn't seem to mind that. What if I throw a bottle at him? Oh god! Ow! No! Leave me alone! Oh shoot! It's a Vortigaun! Can I... Is he still chasing me? No, he's done with me. Oof! Alright, so for those of you who don't know, this game came out in the early 2000s? This is an old school game, man. Hello. Overwatch stopped our train in the woods and Overwatch for questioning. <gasps> Jeff Kaplan. The next train. What have you done? I'm not sure when that was. Did there there be nice though? Oh. Let me wait for him. Welcome. Oh my gosh. Oh, and the thing's replaying. Uh Ooh, we got a drink. You know what? Here, have a drink while you wait. Um wait, wait. I need a no, no, take the drink. <laughs> All right. Anyway, so Half Life Two. This game came out in the early two thousands. Sequel to Half Life One. One of the most groundbreaking games of all time. And this game just. I just wanted to play through it because it's just a fun game, and it's it's almost like a perfect game, in a lot of ways, especially for the time it came out. Like, they don't explain. There's no exposition for what's really going on. You just... You just get put in here. Which, which way am I going? Okay, no? Ow! Oh! 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 oh okay! Okay! Um... Okay. Alright. Um... Hello? Okay. No? All right, I will come with you. You sound different from the others. Um, this must be a mistake. Oh, I got a standard relocation uh -oh. just like everybody else. Hello. Uh, oh god, that guy's dead, isn't he? Oh boy. So I know everything about this game, uh, but I'll I'll try and not reveal as much as possible. Hello. Hello? Uh... <laughs> Alright. Goodbye, Combine. Uh-oh. <laughs> Look! <gasps> it's a human! Dude, so, if, if you play Half-Life 1, this is all the way back from one of the original security guards you rescue, and he was like, Oh, I owe you a beer for saving my life. 
feeding quota. So, um, and that, and that's one of the original scientists that we saved in Half-Life One as well. I don't know what Nova Prospect is, but uh, so this game just drops you right in into this this world. It's 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 alive. You don't know what's going on. You're just kind of exploring it and piecing things together. But the wait, why can I not pick up this book anymore? What about this one? Same. Okay, Gordon. You're gonna have to make your own way to Dr. Kleiner's lab. All right, no problem. Man, that's what I was afraid of. Get in here, Gordon. Before All right. You blow my cover. Okay. Um. Pile up some stuff to get through that window and keep going till you're in the plaza. Ah. Meet up with you later. All right. So here we go. Look at that. All it says is E to pick up object. That's that's all the tutorial you need. Then we go through here. Oh. Damn, loading screens. I forgot these things existed. <laughs> um, but yeah, it just plops you in. You gotta kind of find your own way around. It's amazing. Um, but then, like, you're you're piecing it together, and there's there's tight gameplay. It's interesting, and even with the silent protagonist, you feel so much for Gordon, uh, Doctor Freeman, and in everything that he's doing in his position. Oh, here we go. Um, can't go in there. Um, let's see, out we go, oh, alright, oh, hello there buddy, and if I pick it up, and, <laughs> ow, no, leave me alone, <laughs> he hit me twice, but that wasn't enough, um, Okay, so you all you know is it's like some sort of dystopian society with another, you know, you assume another species kind of like in charge. You're not 100% sure they're another species, but you know that they're, they're something. Um, they're called the Combine. And yeah, look. Oh, yeah. Uh, will they ever get rid of the suppression field and allow us to breed again? So they're suggesting that this race is not allowing mankind to breed for whatever reason. There's an alien thing there. Oh, okay. No, I'm not allowed in there. There's uh, a lot of surveillance drones. So you can get the feeling that this is not this is not a normal place, right? And I'm just like, I remember when, when I was young and we were playing this game, just, okay, he's not letting me go in there because they're interrogating people. Jeez. Um, oh, look at that giant tri tripod thing. All right. Well, it's time for us to go elsewhere. Uh, clearly, we weren't... Uh-oh. So, okay, they're interrogating that dude. What's what's going on here? This is how it always starts. First the building, then the whole block. They have no reason to come to our place. Don't worry, they'll find one. Oh, so they're an oppressive... They're an oppressive people. Oh, look, it's a little dolly. Eh. <laughs> um, yeah, so you're just exploring this world. And we're going to find out what our role is in all of this. Uh, as the game progresses. I just wanted to play this because I love this game. It's that simple, everybody. Welcome, my fellow Hafkastians, to one of the best games of all time. I hope I can do it justice. Um, I was thinking of giving Gordon Freeman a voice. Like, there was a there was a series back in the day uh, on YouTube. I don't know if any of you guys would have seen it. But I think it was called The Mind of Freeman. And this guy essentially just played through Half-Life 1, uh, narrating what Gordon Freeman might say. Um... All right, looks like the lift is out of order. Got to use the stairs. Okay. They're taking someone. Uh, okay. Hello. All right, I got to go in here, I guess. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. 
Nope. It's one of us. Okay. So. Okay, I'm not allowed in there. Oh, jeez. People are really living without anything. That's a huge bathroom, though. Uh, Alright, and we need to keep going through. Okay, I can't go down there. Um, yep, what are, what are we doing in here? Oh god, oh god, oh god, they're killing them all! Can I... Oh god, I can't see what's happening. Are they... Oh, oh god! <laughs> oh my god, I gotta run. <laughs> we gotta head to the roof. No, they're chasing me! Oh god, I don't have weapons yet. Yep, yep. Alright, thanks buddy. Thanks person I don't know. Oh my gosh. We're making a rooftop escape early on in the game, away from the Combine Soldiers. What the hell is that noise? Um, I feel like it loaded halfway. And it like loaded half a sound file and it's just gonna loop it for now. Um, Alright, that's all good. Uh, <laughs> um, so we're running away. We're unarmed. There's a whole bunch of people with sparky slappy sticks. Uh, okay. Let... I think if you listen, you can hear... Yeah, you can hear them break in. Like, they broke down the door. Oh, that poor guy. What a legend, though. Oh, oh shoot! Oh, he's shooting at me! Oh my god! I was gonna throw a can at him, but it's not gonna be good enough. Um, oh, I can... Wait. Wait, I can... Okay, no. Oh, ow. Wait, is he is he still chasing me? No, he's not. I, I th oh, oh shoot! Oh no, that's a lot of uh, that's a lot of pew pew pew. Um, jeez. Oh, oh my God! Leave me alone! I, this is not fair. I gotta get through. Huh. Okay, uh, down the stairs. Okay, the stairs are broken, so I can't backtrack. Oh God. Oh God. Wait, what am I meant to... No! Wait. Wait, what? What's happening? It's, it's a scripted sequence. I'm assuming. Since... That's right! It's this... Mr. Freeman, I presume. Hello there. You're rather attractive. The Combine can be slow to wake, but once they're up, you don't want to get in their way. Um... But, but you killed, like, all of them. What the heck? I don't think it occurred to him that you might not have a map. Y yeah. Who's Dr. Klein? Oh, that's the guy that was on the screen, right? I'm very <gasps> Hello, Alex. I'm sure you don't remember me. Uh, were you a kid? Cuz then that makes this pseudo romantic relationship a bit a bit creepy to be honest. Uh, what are we doing down here? Um him from Black Mesa, your old administrator. Do not remember him, actually. Dad started on Dr. Uh. <laughs> Take this! Thank you for saving me. Alright, um, let's... We will leave this to block the way. Like that. Um, damn, I forgot how many loading points there were in this game. Jesus. <laughs> but yeah, so this is Alex. She's like the pseudo-love interest. Um, but I just realized that they make it really weird because... She's suggesting we knew her as a baby. And I always find that weird when you, like, go out with someone that was like, Oh, I knew you since you were two years old. And it's just like, wow. That's really creepy when you actually think about it. But, um, anyway. Are you showing up on this day in particular? Why? What's so special about this day? Well, okay. Next time on the half cast, we're gonna... We're gonna follow out. Oh, look, she's too cool for the stairs. City on foot. <laughs> Same. But, uh, alright. Well, that's awesome. But next time on the Halfcast, we'll continue following Alex.